Yeah. All right, oh, guys, you just missed it. They were doing a human pyramid. We are here in Thunder Valley in Oklahoma, and we're having a blast. It is a minty fresh kind of day. We're all gonna have a lovely walk around on this once again. This, this look how freaking cool that, that I'm salivating looking at that car. Uh, here in Oklahoma, let's you and me, let's take a walk. Supra, oh, Pretty Mark 4 Super with the Boosty. Oh my God, if only there was, oh my God, there's another Pretty Mark 4 Super with the Boosty. Oh, bless you, child. Oh, we got some Mitsus and oh, we got some titanium from, uh, oh, this guy actually, uh, Rob, he does an amazing job with titanium. I think he's out of the Northwest. We've seen him up near our Seattle and our Oregon shows. He just does, I mean, look, just look at the beautiful work. And I'm like, he's not paying me. He should though. Like, look at the beautiful work that he does. Just, uh, chef's kiss. <laughs> you know what? Never take life too seriously because we're about to race these two against each other. Oh, look at this chaser. Toyota chaser. JDM right here, baby. All right, talking about the chaser, and I, this is this is not hating, but I, I just wouldn't want daddy in my Instagram handle. See, I like Nardo Gray. Some people, you know what? I heard somebody say it looks like a pigeon. Not this car, but the color. And I was like, oh, that's kind of funny. It's kind of true. But I like the Nardo Gray. But it always looks good on a wide body. Like, I've yet to see a wide body or even just flare it out that doesn't look good with the Nardo. Ooh, daddy likey. You see, guys, see what I told you? It's weird when you call yourself daddy. Yeah, see? But uh, still, cool. Uh, cool. Well, I almost said Civic. Ooh, ouch, ouch. Cool. Because of the Honda emblem. Cool Integra is what Keegan meant to say. Ah, Mitsubishi 3000 twin turbo. I miss. I miss when Mitsubishi built badass cars. Ah, uh, what happened? Integra, four-door Integra. Like, I know you guys out there, you're probably like, oh, it's a two-door. Yeah, but there's two sides to the car, four-door. Yeah. Of course, the steering wheel is on the proper side. Rizzle, hizzle, drizzle. But check out that engine bay. Is it just, uh, you know what? I love the saying, K-swap the world. All right, BMW 335 Denzel. Does that, wait, oh my God, Denzel? Denzel, is that you? So I'm looking at this Mustang. Cool build, by the way. And all I can think of is that episode of South Park called Cream Fresh, where you know it, you know, I don't want to get into details, but look at this little Grom just hanging out by his lonesome, by her lonesome, by its lonesome. How does a Grom identify? I identify as a Honda. Uh, look at that little color shift. See, I like when they take like little bikes like that and give it some personality. We're gonna have the school bus against, <laughs> talk about the best of both worlds. This bus, what the, against, you're freaking right, the Lambo. How do, you, how do you feel about what's about to happen? I, uh, I, I, I'm expecting a few bus things between the two of them. Of, we got the GoPro facing him. I love it, a few bus things. All right, here we go. Not just turbocharged Honda S2000, supercharged. Although, if you want to argue semantics, technically, a supercharger is a turbo, turbo supercharge, etc. etc. Anyway, hey, back to the engine. This car just needs to be on a Miami Beach. Just on a Miami Beach. Like this car, twin turbo, by the way, stock. Back when Nissan was doing that cool stuff, all well, the new 400 is twin turbo as well, but it's just pretty. T top, by the way, with the uh, Sparco seats. What a, what a great build. Ah, uh, yes, the vehicle that is the king or queen of texting while driving. Every time I see one, every time I see one, he's on the road, the driver is texting while driving. But uh, I gotta say, I dig the TRD wheels. There's just so much purple right here. We want to go. We want to go. Scion, Mitsu. Scion, Mitsu. Uh, I think it's a Scion. It's got Toyota in front. You know what? If it's an '86, that's fine. That was an FRS. I'm going Mitsu. I flipped a coin and it landed on Mitsu tails. Let's check the inside. That's the theme. Got the theme still going. Look at that. Oh, look at that roll. Ah, oh, multi-point. I like it. Uh, even got the carbon fiber accents on the. Ooh, nicely done. I love attention to detail. And let's give some love to the rear end, right? Guys, we always got to give love to the rear end. Like, oh, cool. Oh, and uh, there you go. It's waifu time. 
Numero uno against There he goes against the deuce. Oh, pretty skyline. I like the color and um yeah, that's what it's about right there. Look at the boosty in the orange RB26. I think it's an RB26, right? I said that one time and they're like, no, that's technically an RB25. Like, okay, okay, okay. I'm like, okay, dude. Okay, I like the skyline. Domestic sport. That was like synchronized walking back. That was very well done. <laughs> Look at our domestic sport compact here. Our four bangers. We love them. I love the, uh, I love the, I'm still laughing about those guys. They like walked back in perfect sync. The camera didn't catch that. Man, you missed it. Um, see, even the Fords, it's even like the, the little STs, you can still have a lot of fun with these. Like this is cool. It's kind of like a like a like I would go in here and be my happy place with these colors. Yep, Honda Love. Yep, this is like a snowplow set up here, but that's just like some air damn aero. Even, you know what? The, that, the espresso brown, weird color, but it's crazy because it works. Yeah, just, I just need 60 seconds. I just gotta think of your sister. All right, who's your money on? Who's your money on? <laughs> the pretty orange pearlescent or um, the, the banana with school PTSD? <laughs> I'm really hoping that the bus driver, that's weird to say, that he leaned out, he was like, almost had you, bro. Uh, this Genesis is not red. Okay, clear your mind. Clear your mind, don't think of the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Clear your mind, now think, Subaru WRX. What's in your brain right now? Is it that? <laughs> What's it? Is that what you thought of? Not the guy in the green hoodie. But like, look at the look at the kit. Like, that is a rally freaking car. I'm a. You just sleep under that. You know, and I was gonna yell Skyline again with the R35, but you know what? I've heard the arguments like, oh, it's not technically Skyline. It's not really a Godzilla. It's just a GTR. I'm like, okay, okay, whatever. It's still, it's still a cool car. Like you'd say no to one. I'm calling it now. I'm guaranteeing it. These cars will be in the low car limbo. Like, I'm calling it. The Honda Beat, the Suzuki Cappuccino. Like, this is what these cars, like, they were engineered for this. But you know the cool thing about these cars is both of them together barely take up one parking spot. It's kind of looking at these and it's like, ah, you know, you, you, you people with the Infinities travel together, you know, car club kind of thing. It's like, I feel like they got those wheels and like, I'm going to go one inch bigger. Screw you, bro. Old school Datsun. I like it. Clean the five speed. Coming over here, we got some more Infinity action. Different colors. Team red, team blue. Which one are you? And of course, probably the prettiest domestic vehicle here today. It's a freaking <laughs> you all with a stranger in camo. But we didn't see him because he's in camo. Who loves a cool wagon? I love a cool wagon. Ah, and they brought two of them. What a great looking pair. Right, I'm gonna tell you a little, uh, a little cheat code for uh, the car scene. You can take any car, whether it's like on a scale of one to 10, it's a three, it's a five, it's a six, six and a half. Take any of them, put them on warts, immediate seven. We're gonna hit what I consider the prettiest angle, the prettiest three quarter on this S2K. Once again, Nardo looks good on anything wide body. Am I wrong? No, I'm totally not wrong. I'm 1,010% right. And uh, yeah, even if you wanna hate on that color and call it pigeon or primer, still looks pretty on the wide body. To me like Nardo gray is kind of like nerd glasses on like a hot girl. It just makes her hotter. Pick a color, what color is this? It's like a chameleon lizard snake raptor green yellow. 
you get one guess and one guess alone what their favorite color probably is. Man, there is just a lot of red on the screen. But as previously mentioned, see how the gorgeous titanium? What, look, I told you, like this guy, Rob, who does like just look at all that. That is a that's just tasty titanium. Like, dude, props. I might just go to this guy and have my entire like bone structure rebuilt. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm getting my entire bone structure redone with that guy's titanium. We'll come back next episode with Wolverine and be like, Schling. Titanium. As I was living in Dream World, hey, never let go of your dreams. Uh, who doesn't want to be a superhero? Some people want to be a supervillain, but th that's a whole different me mental disorder. Um, this is sure pink, but you know, it's kind of a, it's like a glossy pink, but kind of a pastel. Ooh. And see cool attention to detail like this, like having the air container also match the body. And our lovely import face-off models, hey, eyes back to me. So we're just checking out this not a Miata behind me. I love the color. He got his tickets at thefolk.com. And the reason I'm thinking that is because if he got his tickets at thefolk.com, that means that he is guaranteed a spot at the show. He doesn't have to worry about showing up and being like, hey, do you have any spots left? Also, when he shows up, he has a QR code that's gonna be personalized for him and he can customize his ride. So every ticket event forward from thefolk.com, his ride's gonna come with him. And if he wants to add any mods at the very last second, he can put it on there. And that's why we get our tickets at thefolk.com. Well done. <laughs> I ponder this. If you have four Lexuses, is it four Lexuses? Is it Lex eyes? Is it Lexum? What is it? How many Lexus do you have? Six. You have. I thought four. All right. So how would you say I have six? I have six Lexuses. Lexuses. Lexus. Lexus. Lexi. I, I think all of them are right. It's like octopus or octopi. It's like octopuses. Octop yeah. So Lex. I don't know. Lexon. Lex. I Lex. And the debate continues. I feel like this needs to be the center place in the Manhattan Louis Vuitton store. Like when you walk in and they have like, you know, the fragrances and stuff like that, they should have just this sitting there just because it's, it's absurd. It's ridiculous. It's a ruckus. Okay. It's food review time. And what are we getting for food review? What, what kind of food? No fucking idea. We don't even know. I got to bleep that, but we don't <laughs> even know yet. Hello and welcome from warm Oklahoma. Where our girls, oh, what, what temperature would you say it is right now? I'm gonna say it's probably a wind chill of Great, all right, 32. so guys, it is 32. All right, it's time to uh, to chow down here at the track at Thunder Valley. Um, and what do we have here, guys, that we got from a, a shop called Corn and Potatoes? And Fresh Hot Dog. And Fresh Hot Dog, that's a long LLC name. All right, mm -hmm. Medea, what do, you, what do you have, what do we got? Um, it's a make-do New York style. Looks like shredded wallpaper on there. All right, what <laughs> we got, take a bite to what you think? Here at Thunder Valley. Pick a number, an even number. Mm, I'm gonna say a nine. A nine, perfectly even number. What you got? Chili cheese. Chili cheese, okay. A favorite of people who uh, wanna keep people away from their face for the rest of the day. All right, what you got? A perfectly odd number. Mm, like a five. Okay, somebody knows how even and odd works. You do oh, great. Oh, I thought you were meaning like full, like even numbers. Nope, that's not like gonna save, like that's not gonna save you. All right, but what you got? You have? Awesome. Are they freshly made? Are they like local? Uh, they're gourmet. All right, gourmet. All right, and tell me what you think. I will. Okay. Even with, I thought you were going to tear into that with those nails. And uh, irrational number. 13. Not, okay. Okay. Well, just, sure. And guys, I have corn. Nope, not putting that in my mouth on video. This has been our food review at Thunder Valley. Let's get back to the cars. <laughs> Low rider, slow rider. With the engine work, the wheels all just nice and tucked in. Yes, now a lot of these we see the suicide doors on, but I kind of like the original doors. I kind of like the way it does that. And I love like the paint scheme. That's cool. This is a, I hate to call this a dying art. It is kind of a dying art, but beautiful nonetheless. Oh my God, IFO. Oh my God, Oklahoma. Oh my God, okay. OMG, okay. We had such an awesome time today. By the way, the, the, the Minty Civic, best in show. Uh, ladies, do we have a good time today? No. I'm cold. They suffer for their beauty. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next episode. Make sure to check out the two stuff in limbo. Hey, Oklahoma, what's up? We thought we ended the video, but then we came to our hotel here and uh, you guys threw a tornado at us. Uh, 
Thanks. See you next episode. Maybe.